Hey everybody, welcome back to Pop Pop Tarot. If you'd like to book a read with me, hit the email in the description box. Okay, thank you guys for your likes, your shares, and your subscribes. Like, I'm fucking with y'all. And y'all fucking with me, so we fucking with each other. Okay, so I'm bringing y'all, um, my channel is mainly for the divine feminine. I don't care, okay? Like, I had a heart. I still, I'm still having a heart, but let me, my baby girls gotta have my baby girls, okay? Cause y'all deserve love, you are lovable. And this was my hardest thing, and that's what the twin flame journey is about. So, love, okay? So, and I forever feel like I'm a teacher to y'all, like, and to the men, and to whoever. And not even just twin flame shit or the one feminine shit, cause, you know, but, um, everybody. Look at why you need to smile because shit, I'm gonna, eat, I'm gonna be talking shit in this house, so you know, you could scoot it on some, and I'll be, you know, I feel like it goes, I feel like in my videos, I go a wide range, but I feel like it all makes sense, so it gotta be making sense. So I'm bringing y'all this reading, uh, from y'all's divine mask one, okay, and it seems like he might have a lot to say. Oh. At the bottom of the deck here, we have release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy and have them hoes are shooting out. Okay. I ain't even gonna take them and try to take them in no kind of order, but this one did fall out first. So, oh, that's why I fell out first. We have this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you see. So, DM, DF, y'all know each other. Okay. Soulmate, whatever the fuck. Your significant other. Y'all know each other. Okay. We got new love. A new love has stirred their many feelings. This could be new. Okay. So you could just now be coming into contact with your DM. Or this this DM is just now realizing this shit. Okay. Yeah. Or it's just now it's time to be coming together. Now, now it's the time just for the shit to happen. It's time for the shit to come together. Okay, like your spirit guys and his spirit guys can talk to each other and now they're like, okay, yeah. So this could be the one and we have new love, a new person to your romantic feelings. Okay, honeymoon, enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. He could be thinking about marrying your ass, okay, thinking about y'all honeymoon and shit. He really could be thinking like, damn, you the one. And well, this person is, it. She either he's shorter than her or he down on his fucking knee, but you know, he giving her something. This definitely very much could be a proposal. And look how he got her hand, you know, and that way. So, you know, DM very much is feeling like, damn, like I want to marry her. Like this might be my future wife, fiance, okay? So some of y'all possibly could be getting proposed to, or DM is thinking about proposing to you, okay? We got passion, allow your heart and soul to sing with joy, and I feel like you feel the same, okay? Or when, or when he do come around, you know, this is it. When he do come around, okay? We got playfulness to recapture romance. Allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Okay? Yeah, you fucking with it too. Y'all fucking with each other. Okay? He wants you to be open with him. Like, he, he wants you to, like, know that he feel the same way too. Okay? So, if he got to do a gesture to show you that, that's what he'll do. Like, I feel like, you know... He just wants it to be some light energy. Divine Master wants it to be some light energy between you and him. Not nothing too serious. It's serious, but like the energy between y'all, like he wanted to stay playful. Because it's like he here, he ain't going nowhere. Yeah, getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Like he wants you to be open with him. He wants you to express yourself to him like he's expressing himself to you. Because it seems like you got a lot of shit to express. But I do feel like it was tension that you, to be, you just be holding back and shit. We got forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. So this person, he could be now learning from his past mistakes and letting that shit go with this release your ex. And then she, you could be doing the same shit too. But now it's kind of like, you know better. You know what I mean? But at the same time, it's, 
I'm, I'm gonna leave it at that. You know better, okay? Like, so both of y'all at a point to where it's kind of like y'all know better. And yes, this is new, but shit, I feel like this is it. And the passion, yeah, the passion is there, like as far as the sexual level, but shit, they still are fully or still fully fucking dressed, okay? Unless they just ain't got no fucking bottoms on, okay? And it's, it's hot and he that's hot and heavy, you know? Like, shit, just bam, bam, thank you, ma'am, you know? But it ain't just that, though, like it's more than that, but it's like. That's like how much y'all are into each other and shit. Yeah, yeah this divine like masculine could be a little kinky. Okay, with this little whip in his hand. And she like, woo. Woo. Oh my goodness. Okay, this he is attractive and he do look like he is something what of importance. Woo. Mm hmm. <laughs> Yeah, so but that's on getting to know each other. So you never, you never know. Like, so this is because y'all just begin to know each other, and you know, like, like you are attracted to him as he is attracted to you. Okay. But either way, they letting that old shit go, and it's old. These old bitches trying to come back around with some new shit, new this, this, and I feel like it's getting old here with this. Yeah, really, shit, it's getting old here. This feminine energy, but. Not to worry. Like, well, something could be had because he could have been pushing you away too. You know, um, we know how that go. So we have pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. Yeah, we know how that go. Okay, so I mean, but you have to look. You have to take it with that energy. Okay, so these, like, mm -mm, mm -mm. you know how that shit go. No, yeah, they can open test, but when they open them, they can. But at the end of the day, if we're looking on this end, like, both of y'all feel bad about the shit, okay? So, both of y'all did some shit that both of y'all feel bad about. If we're talking about this, it's just y'all together. Like, he knows that you feel bad, and you know that he feels bad. And then y'all both might still be fucking mean to each other and shit or whatever, but y'all still fucking with each other. Okay, pay attention to red flags. They're not always bad, okay? They are good, too. They're not always bad. They're good, too. Then we have healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. Okay? So, I feel like this has nothing to do with you, feminine. And it doesn't. These are all having to do with his own and your own issues. That's why it's a self-journey. Okay? The, the coming together... Of y'all to the MDF, the divine feminine, the divine masculine is like the cherry on top. Shit, the journey is the whole goddamn cake because you grow, like, you grow, you change, you transform, okay? Life is the best, life is the best, okay? And that's like what this is. Okay, so we got, um, this could be the one. Yeah, really sure it's coming out again. Let that shit go. Okay, Devon Maslin is knowing that he needs to release your ex. And if this your DM, then you should know that you need to release your ex too. Duh. Duh. Hello. Okay. Or if you give, yeah, flirt. Both of y'all, like, do this. Okay. We got new love here. I feel like, and his ex knows that, like, she needs to release him. Like, let it go, sis. We got new love, religious practice. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. Under that new love, okay? Yes, you get a, a sense of self. You get a sense of self-love for yourself, okay? So, it's kind of like, yes, y'all y'all would be vibing on the same level. He will be feeling like you the one because you feel like you the one, okay? Yeah, heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. And then it's like, okay, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Let's, let's, let's do this thing. Let's be together, okay? You feeling like you a goddess. He feeling like he a god. He's your twin. Why wouldn't he? 
Okay, we got honeymoon, finances and careers. That makes sense for honeymoon, okay? Enjoy the little holiday time together. Finances and careers. Financial issues are affecting your love life right now. I feel like there's a sense, okay, two things. I'm getting there's a sense like you can chill right now and just fucking relax. Or you can save your quince up for this fucking honeymoon, okay? Because, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I'm sure, I'm sure baby daddy, I'm sure he gonna take care of you and shit, but at the same time, too, you might have some shit that you might want to get. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> you might have some shit that you might want to get. Just like you got him with his soulmate and very soon. But I feel like this, whatever this was, came in and you took it. Okay? It was kind of like, eh. But you was willing to work at it, whatever this situation is, okay? And he knows that. The mom also knows that you're willing to work at it, and he want to work at it. You see? It? Yep. Yeah, retreat. Yeah, he for sure want to work at it. We got honeymoon and retreat. So, y'all honeymoon might be on a retreat. It might be on some water or some retreat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't think you're on, like, water and shit, big-ass pool and shit, whatever the fuck. Okay? It's, got, it's time to disconnect for the world. That is a honeymoon where it's just you and him under passion. Like, this, he... He want to get you alone, okay? Like, he's going to offer you some type of getaway to get your ass alone, okay? Attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. He wants you. Yeah, he just, he just wanted to be you and him. Nobody else. Nothing. Yeah. Trust. Because he wants you to be able to trust his ass. He wants you to be able to trust his ass. He knows these bitches going to be steady coming and shit and trying to fuck with him shit. But he knows that it's you. Okay, it's also too. This could be the one, could be possibly. Okay, calling me and your soulmate. I'm gonna take that on the playfulness because both of y'all is here. Okay, to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Be fucking like, come on, never playing and shit. You calling in your soulmate and shit. Your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring you together. Dream. Okay, that's what I'm saying. Save your coins and shit. Okay, that's also like, you know what I'm saying? Saving your fucking coins. It's also kind of like making a list. Okay, type shit. Like, just make it go with how it fucking goes. Okay, your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring the two together. So, y'all are both on the same shit. Y'all is doing the same shit. Okay, like. He do too. This is something that you've been praying for, and the whole time it's kind of like it's here as well as the whole time it, it, it's fucking coming in, and it's gonna be a fucking savior too. Like I feel like this person got wings, and it's kind of you know the the masculine energy behind it he got wings, so he ready, he ready, okay, he ready. He got his wings, and here he got his wings too on this passion card. He ready, he ready. He looking back like damn, I should have had him then. I should have had him then. Okay, so this could be a coming back around situation or some shit like that. Yeah, I'm required to love. Maybe before, shit, he wasn't fucking with your ass, but then he fucking with your ass type shit. But that needs to happen here with this forgiving and learning. There obviously was a lesson that needed to be learned between you and your divine nasa. And it could very much be with family issues, okay? And that, if if that didn't stem down to y'all, that means his parents and your fucking parents. Y'all need to heal that. Okay? Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. You know? Like, now it's time. Like, okay. Look at this shit. Or even just family. Sisters, brothers, cousins, whatever the fuck. Like, look at this shit. Okay? We got to get into know each other here. Chemistry. The destroying negative attraction here. We got passion out here. Okay? Yeah. Like, when, even when when this person got to know, this person chose. And it was like, okay, yeah, it's this one. And you, and you feel the same way about him. You, know I mean? you can always just come up at seven. That's even if you fuck with somebody else or not. That's if this is a new love or not. You're going to always be you. And if you are going to, this whole journey is hard. But if you're going to stick to it, you're going to fucking get there. Okay, and so is him because you are leading the connection for him to come to you. Yes, he leads the connection. Yes, he do. Okay, but you lead the fucking connection on the 5D. Okay, he might lead the connection on the 3D, but on the 5D, you lead the motherfucking connection. Okay, and when the 5D and 3D is balanced, that's when you get the shit. That's when you get the shit coming in. Okay, and that's when you get the shit coming in. What is forgiving and learning?
forgiving and learning. We got to make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you got it to take. Okay? He knew that he should have did that shit. Okay? He knew that he should have came in and offered this just period. Okay? Just from back then, when, whenever, like, he knows that shit now. Okay? And also, too, I'm, I'm getting the real... I don't really even like to get that deep like that, but I'm getting a real vibe of like, y'all not gonna have to go through that shit no more, okay? Worth waiting for, feminine, you waited, okay? With this religious factors here, you you weren't fucking around. Some of y'all probably was silly bit, some of y'all probably was asking it. Or you, if you did fuck around, it was on your turn when you wanted to do it type shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, you, you was good, you was chilling, okay? Divine time is there working your work life. Like you, it was, it didn't do, it become deeper than that, okay? It becomes way fucking deeper than that, okay? I feel like, too, some of y'all, now again, yeah, now again, when it's time, in like another lifetime, reconciliation, someone from your past is return to your life. And also now, too, and also you and him could be getting back around and shit. But if this is past life shit, like what I'm finna be talking about is I sound like going too deep. But if this is past life shit, y'all not gonna have to fucking deal with that shit no more. But the lesson this time in this life was you deserve, was you knowing that you was lovable, okay? And that's also, too, loving your motherfucking self, okay? So... You you had to fucking know this shit for this shit to happen. And it's making sense because it's fucking happening. Reconciliation is coming together. It's here. So, mate, okay? It's coming together. It's here now. So, if, if you think and you look back on it, you know what I'm saying? Like, rejection is God's protection, okay? And if you are in contact with your DM, you, you'll notice that shit. You'll see that shit. You'll see that, like, bro... That ain't, you know what I'm saying? Like, you'll see that you got to where you are right here, right now for a reason. Okay? Pay attention to the red flags. We got attraction. You're not even attracted to the same shit no more. You don't even like the same fucking shit no more, okay? And this person, this DM is realizing how fucking attracted he is to you. We have passion out here, chemistry, and attraction. Those are all three cards of, like, what somebody motherfucking want. Yeah, trust. At the bottom of the day, you ain't got shit to fucking worry about, okay? He knows that the passion is here equally, okay? The chemistry is here equally. You want to know if you if he's attracted you want to know? Hell yeah. Okay? You want to... You worrying about if he like you, if he think you said you this, you that, you worrying if he looking at other... No. Okay? You doing too much worrying about that shit. Because this shit was good for me. Like, he... He attracted. Okay? He type, like, little boys be mean to the girls they like. <laughs> type shit. This this that man, Dude, what's that? What's that noise? Your hair looks so cute. Did you go look at did you look at it in the mirror? Yeah. No, you didn't. Go look. It's cute. Tell me what you like. No, it. when it was calming it, I was just looking at the mirror. Oh, okay. Healing family issues. We have trust. The situation is calling for you to have faith. You can trust this, okay? And you can trust that he gonna fix it, he gonna work it out. Okay, and you can trust that that's all I'm saying. Like it's never gonna happen no more. Okay, so when this type time and the next one and the next one and this one is okay. This was gonna be hours and that was just gonna be days, okay? <laughs> we have separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. That's that release your So he yeah, like I let that shit go. Yeah, justice karma. Like, God let that shit go. And I feel like he's letting that shit know. Be known. I said that in the Mm hmm. Letting that shit be known. Down, down. That must be that mother. Who that is? Oh, okay. Okay. Um, oh, I, had a, I had a FaceTime failed again. So, the overall energy is separation. So, you and this person could possibly not be together right now. Huh? Yeah, but the Nine of Pentacles is a happy home, but it's a single lady. So, but you, so yeah, y'all could be like apart from each other right now. It could, it could be some distance in between y'all right now. 
But I feel like that don't matter though. Don't trip. Passion, chemistry, attraction out here. Don't trip. Don't trip. Yeah, trust also is out here. So don't trip. So it gets like some distance in between right now. With this separation being the overall energy. Because y'all not separating. And the separation is a big thing. Yeah. It could be some some distance here with this page of wands. But this is that communication coming in. So he gonna call you. He gonna message you. He gonna talk to you. Okay, this is this is an idea, a plan. He this would be a honeymoon. This would be a treat. Okay, but this would be somebody seeing you in their future. Okay. So yes, and he gonna he gonna let your ass know that shit. <laughs> also too the daughter of ones in this deck is someone that's going through a spiritual awakening so he's on his spiritual awakening that's what i'm saying he here like you know that's what i'm saying okay yeah the hermit card he is wise he's wiser now okay and, and he's still studying and he's still you know he's learning okay he's reaching he's growing okay he might even want to talk to you about some shit the fact that he got you know plans and shit like the communication is coming in like i like that shit now be watch out though pay attention to the red flag just because it's still a snake okay but it could be a snake that bite or it could be a snake that you know that just that, that eat the bugs and shit or, or whatever the fuck them you know them snakes that don't bite people and fuck what people do okay yeah but he's starting all the way for a it could have started off like that it could have, but we had that with that forgiving and learning. So, yeah, it did. It started out with him on some bullshit, but now the shit looked like the only person that he wanted to bite you. Okay? So, you can't... Yeah, the offer is coming after you. you. Yeah. Like, he's extending the offer to you. Okay? We have this Ace of Cups here. Okay? This is also the page that is new. So, he, like... He wants you to choose him. Like, he wants you to take his offer up and not nobody else's offer up. And also, too, this is that new love, Ace of Cups. Okay? So, this person could want to start over again. Okay? Take this leap of faith with you. Okay? For some of y'all, maybe even a lope with this time required here. Quietly. You know? This time required here. He did have to leave a situation with that man. Like, he did have to you know, leave the situation. <laughs> just period. He did have to leave the situation to come here towards you. But so, just think about that. If he already was breaking up with somebody or in a breakup and then he got with you, there was no healing in between that, okay? That's kind of, as you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. So that's why he was coming in like this at first. And that's why he bit your ass because he was just coming in with all this passion and heat and whatever, Okay? But now I feel like he's coming in with this love. He wants to give you this cup of love, this ace, this ace of cups, this overflow of emotions, okay? Like, the shit that comes out of this cup, now his plans, the shit that comes out of this cup is actually going to be what it is, what he all, what he initially wanted to, it to be from fucking jump. But lessons needed to be learned here in this situation, okay? They did. He's still going to talk to you, and he is scared to talk to you, okay? Like, because the Ace of Cups here, you might actually, like, be... Well, for one, you are a new love to him. Like, so he do love you, and it's not just sex, okay? So let's not, let's not get that confused, but it's like... Yeah, it's a fear here. It's risky, and it is foolish, okay? So it is dumb, whatever this is. But shit, he want to fucking do it, though. Yeah, and he going to fucking do it, King of Wands, Okay? He's gonna fucking do it and he sees himself as doing whatever this plan is with you for some of y'all for, for shit y'all could be a proposal and he could be scared because he's like man what if i do this and then she try to fucking leave me and shit and then i do this shit again you know like or that might be a thing like where is the stability where where is the solidness you know what i mean but i don't feel like this person is gonna bite because he didn't switch he ain't change over. This is going to stay the same. Okay? So, now he want to come in and be for real. Okay? Yeah. Ten of Pentacles. Okay? Now, he want to come in and be for real in the whole thing. Now, he, he he always seen the whole thing with you. And he really want to work on seeing that whole thing with you. Ten of Pentacles. You can for shit show, trust the situation. The loyalty is there. Okay? The King of Wands, that is a spouse. That is a counterpart. He sees himself being your counterpart. Okay? And if that is on a passion level, passion, chemistry, attraction, then, yeah, that's for sure, like, no, on that level, nobody is taking that away from you. Like, it's you, okay? 
it's you. Yeah, justice card, yeah. And he wants to give you justice, and he wants to give you that. So, some of y'all, y'all could be, like, you know what I'm saying, not doing nothing, nothing like that, like I said earlier, okay? And if not, he, he wants to give you that. And love, okay? So, he want to give you dick and love. He want to give, yeah, for your pimple. Okay, he want to work together with you. He want to collaborate. Page of Wands could also be a pregnancy or pages for representing children. Okay, I did see the children card a little over there. It didn't come out yet. So, you know, so this is something. That, but these are thoughts of planning. Okay, the Ten of Pentacles, that is a family. So, hell yeah, yeah. you know. And he ain't leaving his family. He gonna favor work out. Even if he do do some dumb ass shit, he, always, he gonna come right the fuck back around here. So, this DM, no. But this could be the one that's here. Like, this this DM, no. So, I mean, you ain't gotta worry if you can... You ain't got to worry about all the other shit, okay? Like, you better choose up on him because he coming. He ain't going nowhere. He here. What is this page of wands? What is this page of wands? Oh, my God. With the page of wands, I got the magician card here. Yeah. He want to bring you the whole motherfucking shebang. He always wanted to bring you the whole motherfucking shebang, but he was playing some games because he was immature a little bit with the plans and shit and kind of scared. Like, the, the plans are still the fucking same, but it's like, now he really want to do that shit. It's not no in and out fire. Like, I don't fucking know what the fuck this was. Like, nah, maybe it was a thing about trust, you know? Maybe it was a thing about divorce with the hermit card here and the justice card. I feel that, you know, like, so there was a need to really, like, damn, can this go this distance, can this fucking last, because I do want to give this person my everything, can I actually really give them my everything here, and I feel like, for some of y'all, y'all are going to be very successful with this Ten of Pentacles, okay, this is happiness, this is the whole thing, this completion, okay, some of y'all, shit, very much will be taking motherfucking retreat with the money that y'all got, okay, King of Wands, that is somebody that's in the public eye, Okay, if he is creative, he's the best at what the fuck it is that he do. Okay, when y'all could be a magician, he might see himself being a magician. He might be a magician, you know. Like, I feel like this person wants to talk about their plans and shit with you. Okay, yeah, they might say a little shit or whatever. The moon card he giving you illusions and shit, or it could just be a secret, you know. Something could be a secret, some shit could be low key here. Mm hmm. Five Pentacles, like, so you could be leaving them out, or maybe that's why you left this person out, This or how maybe how this person is making you feel left out, but you you not left out. It's, it's, he want to talk to you. You, you are in the plans, sis. <laughs> you are definitely for shit show in the plans. What is the Hermit card here? We gonna go get some donuts. Okay? Yeah. Oh, some donuts going to fill with jelly. He going to like it. What's it? We'll talk about it. I want the regular. Regular what? Donuts? Regular donuts. Okay, we're going to. <laughs> we got the two ones here. Okay, you and this person on the same direction. Yeah, maybe this person needs to realize some shit. You see how, like, he just needs to realize, like, we want the same. Nigga, I said we're going to get some donuts. Donuts and regular donuts are the same thing, okay? So it was something like that, okay? Like, and this person was a page. That is my son. <laughs> it was something like that, something fucking stupid. Like, but I said, I want to fucking do this. Like, come on now. So now y'all both on the same page with this shit, okay? Before, uh, it was it was a fear here on his end for him to not even come out as the king of ones first if he was going to come out as the king of ones regardless. Okay, so this wasn't on you. This was a fear on him, okay? Yeah, the world card. He had to complete those toxic cycles of holding on to burdens, okay, and not letting them hoes go, okay, because if you want to come into everything with me, with this Ten of Pentacles, you're going to have to let that shit go, because you're going to, now you're going to have to carry the weight of me, okay, and with this ex cousin, this Ten of Pentacles, shit, I'm a lot, okay, you know what I'm saying, like, and you are, the world card, that is completion, that is wholeness, okay, you is the whole thing, just like for him, you see him as being the fucking whole thing. That's why you steady working it with that finance and careers. You steady putting in the work. Okay? And that was a burden for you for steady working on this eight of pentacles. But at the same time, too, it was still manageable, dude, because it's why you was working on you. Okay? And then when he come in, you probably, you gonna start to work on him, too. But you working on you, and then if this is your mate, it's only right that you better than, too. 
So it's like, yeah, that would be a burden. Because it's like, okay, I got me, I got you, I got the kids, I got this, I got that. You know what I'm saying? It will be a burden. So you ain't got time for all this extra ass shit. Okay? So, but now he worried about you having some extra ass shit. And I feel like you don't. Like, and this person, they have learned their lessons. It's like, it's, they are wise. They're not, they, that's why he coming up as a king of ones now. He went from the page, he grew up. Especially when it came on a level of, what this what, what he feeling for okay he grew up okay he needed to start over and it happened fast too that's also the king the page ones and the king ones it happened fast okay it is because when he say some shit he don't fucking do that and i like that okay i like that it came as the page of ones to the king of ones because he said some shit okay and he gonna do that and that's also with this now when this communication come in he gonna say some shit and he gonna do that What's the fool part? So if I get a weapon, and if I see you, I'm gonna kill you. Hey. Okay. I can't because I don't got a weapon. What time is it? You, 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 what? Where's the, where's that dirt? That looks like 11. That looks like 11. Okay, so yeah. The person wants start all the way over okay the death card right here this is also closure this is transformation this is also that dumb ass shit he tried that dumb ass shit and failed okay so now he's gonna try some some shit and possibly make it work yeah nine of pentacles might be successful okay then he want to do a solo dolo mission okay then he wanna, and he wants he won't choose solo dolo okay yeah as towards now he thinking yeah so this is him thinking back on some shit like I should have just, I should have just kept, you know what I'm saying? Like, I thought, this person thought some shit, that is one's energy, okay? Communication and think and, and communication and thinking, they like thought, and thought wrong or something like that, like, but either way, you still steady worked out on you, because we would, the Ten of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles already out here, and then I'm like, you, you steady stayed on you, you steady stayed on you. What's this Ace of Cups? And said, you know, loving him. What is this Ace of Cups? He wants to be successful, the cherry card here. And he will be. He will be successful and triumphant in bringing you this new cup of love, okay? He will be, and he's coming towards you fast. This is happening fast, okay? Like, he knew that this was the one. Like, fuck all that other shit. This is it, okay? We got the devil card here. It ain't no fucking stopping him. It's, this is success for sure, okay? Especially with this Ten of Pentacles. It ain't no motherfucker stopping him. Yeah, Ace of Swords, victory. Communication as well. Crystal clear clarity. A new beginning in clarity. Like, there's no more... None of this shit, okay? But like, the devil card, if we talking on sexual level, passion, chemistry, and attraction out here, it's all here with you. Like, this, this is it, okay? He's obsessed with you, with this nine of pentacles, ten of pentacles, he ain't fucking going nowhere. But he knew that this is the one. Look, nine of cups flipping out. Yeah, two of swords. And then he feel he want to know, like, are you as clear as him now? He want to know. He want to know, are you as clear as him now? We got the king of one, because I find and left. I finally done, I'm finally done with all that bullshit. Now, is you really here for me now? Ace of cups. But this is not the Ace of Cups, it's the King of Cups. On top of the King of Wands, okay? He, he he know now. He ain't playing. He ain't manipulating. No King of Swords coming out. He not being a manipulator. Ain't none of that, okay? Yeah, he holding on. Not a Wands. For shit show, this could be somebody asking you to propose. Him. He for shit show holding on. He ain't playing no games, okay? So this, the Hermit Card too, you need to be open and honest with yourself, you know, about what it is that you're going to do. Because for some of y'all, y'all going to let him go. Y'all going to leave him alone. Y'all going to do some other shit. And the same, like, you still going to be good with whoever the fuck this is that's coming in that's wanting to stick around with your ass. Is this Ten of Pentacles? Yeah, Three of Pentacles. You still going to work together and collaborate with somebody. Okay? But if Joe D want you to like what he wants you to know that he want to fuck with you. Yeah, King of Cups, Queen of Cups. So we got a match room. Y'all looking at each other. Y'all want to work together. Yeah, three of swords. Y'all want to work together. Y'all, y'all want to sign y'all name on the dotted line. Y'all want to take that risk 
of going through that heartbreak of that of that divorce and shit. Y'all want to do that shit, okay? Y'all want to jump the broom. Y'all want to move forward to shit. Y'all want to elope, okay? Y'all want to go take it down to the end. Death do us part. This masculine is very sexual, okay? I feel, feel, I feel like he probably likes to drink and shit. He likes to go fast and shit. I don't fucking know. <laughs> yeah, ace of woods, seven of woods. Like, he on it. Ten of cups, but it's what he want to do. And what he want to do is you. Both ways. Always. Shit. Both ways. Okay, we got the two of cups. And I'm thought you feel the exact same way, but passion, chemistry, and attraction is here. Y'all feel the fucking exact same way, two of cups, okay? This love is going to grow. It is going to go to something, okay? Yeah, ace of wands. Okay, he want to give it to you. He want to give you this cup of love. He want to give you this dick. He want to give you this money. He want to give you his name. Eight of ones, quickly, okay? He's calling. He wants to talk to you, okay? Like, he, he want to communicate, okay? He want to fucking communicate. The fuck? 